Chapter 25, Apples My birthday is October the 10th. I like my birthday, the 10th of the 10th. Would have been great if I was born at exactly 10.10 10 in the morning or at night, but I wasn't. I was born just after midnight, but I still think my birthday is cool. I usually have a little party at home, but this year I asked Mum if I could have a big bowling party. Mum was surprised but happy. She asked me who I wanted to ask in my class. And I said, everyone in my homeroom, for summer. That's a lot of kids, Augie, said Mum. I have to invite everyone because I don't want anyone to get their feelings hurt. They find out other people are invited and they aren't, OK? OK, agreed Mum. You even want to invite the what's the deal kid? Yeah, you can invite Julian, answered. I answered. Jeez, Mum, you should have forgotten about that already. I know, you're right. A couple of weeks later, I asked Mum who was coming to my party, and she said, Jack Quill, Summer, Reed Kingsley, both Maxes. And a couple of other kids said they were going to try to be there. Like who? Charlotte's mum said she had a dance recital earlier in the day, but she was, going, she was going to try to come to your party with Tan and Lau. And then, and Tristan's mum said he might come after his soccer game. So that's it, I said. That's like five people. That's more than five people, Augie. I think a lot of people just have plans already, Mum answered. In the... We were in the kitchen. She was cutting up apples. We had got them at the farmer's market into tinsy weensy bites so I could eat it. What kind of plans, I asked. I don't know, Augie. We sent out the invites kind of late. Like, what did they tell you, though? What reasons did they give? Everyone gave different reasons, Augie. She, she sounded a bit impatient. Really, sweetie, it shouldn't matter what their reasons were, but but people had plans. That's all. What did Julian? What did Julian give his reason? I asked. You know, his mum was the only person who didn't RSVP at all. She looked at me. I guess the apple doesn't fall. I guess the apple doesn't fall far from the tree. I laughed because I thought she was making a joke, but then I realised she wasn't. What do you mean? I asked. Never mind. Now go wash your hands so you can eat. My birthday turned, my birthday party turned out to be much smaller than I thought it would be, but it was still great. Jack, Summer, Reed, Tristan, and both Maxes came from school, and Christopher came too, all the way from Bridgeport with his parents. And Uncle Ben came, and Aunt Kate, and Uncle Pearl drove from Boston, though Tata and Papa were in Florida for the winter. But it was still fun because all the grown-ups ended up in a bowling lane next to us, so it really felt like there was a lot of people there to celebrate my birthday.